What's going on, folks? TJ Lowerman, a.k.a. That Sports Gamer here. Uh, it's been a while since I brought you a Mutt update from my team. Uh, as you can see, we're 91 overall right now. So let's hop in here and see who we're playing with. Got a great squad here. Let's start with the offensive line. We got Smith, Carpenter, Khalil, Lang, and Clark. Uh, main reason for this line being built this way is everybody is pretty much 90 plus in pass block and run block ratings. Uh, the main offender right now that is not is Khalil. Uh, you can see he is only at, uh, he's got 97 run block, which is great, but he's got only three, 83 pass block. So he's a guy that might be uh, next to get upgraded on this team. Uh, but most of these other guys are 90 plus in both. I think Lang might be an 88. Nope, he's 90 plus in both. Uh, but I know Carpenter's got 88 run block, I believe it is. Yeah, 88 run block. So I'm trying to get a nice balanced offensive line so I can do stuff like run the shovel option, but still have the confidence when I option when I audible out of the shovel option uh, to be able to get good blocking for my quarterback up front. Uh, over here with the tight ends, we got Eifert and Jordan Reed, both beastly receiving uh, tight ends, as you can see. Uh, we got 92. 92 route running from uh, Jordan Reed is pretty amazing. Uh, they both got speed, 86 and 87, 90 catch, 93 catch, and both big targets. So I like having both those guys out there. Uh, we got Marcel Reese here as the third tight end, just because he's got that great blocking ability, which is also why he's the starting fullback. Uh, at quarterback, we have the ultimate freeze, Mariota. Love this card. I've loved every Mariota card that's come out this year. 91 speed, 95 throw power, 94 short, 96 medium, 88 deep is not bad. Uh, then we got Carson Palmer here also. He's essentially the same, just a little bit less on the deep and a little bit less speed. Uh, so I like having him around just in case something happens. Uh, at the running back positions, we got Clinton Portis, the legend. He might be getting gone soon. Uh, I think he's only got 93 speed, so uh, I'm looking for something a little, or 94 speed. So I'm looking for something a little bit faster right now. Uh, recently won a giveaway to get the signature Reggie Bush, uh, who's got plus two elusiveness, which I really like. Uh, I've been using him a lot on third downs to receive, uh, so I'm just going all out offense. Reggie Bush has been extra helpful for me. Uh, also, we got the ultimate freeze Tavon Austin out of position card because he's got the 97 speed for when I am running the read option with him and Mario or the shovel option with him and Mariota. Wide receivers, we got legend Michael Irvin uh, on the one. We got Heinz Ward in the slot, and Brandon Cooks with his, I think it's a 97 speed, just blowing the tops off defenses, uh, 96 speed. Uh, loving that card. If you saw it in there, we have Julio, John, Julio Jones and a DeAndre Hopkins. I'll tell you about that a little bit more in a few minutes. Uh, then we got Reggie Bush in the five spot and the Amari Cooper. This was the, uh, this was the one you get for doing that uh, set of solos. So here we go, 91, 11, 95 speed is great, 95 catch. He's not terribly bad compared to uh, Michael Irvin. Uh, the only real big difference is like seven on his release. Other than that, they're pretty comparable, which is pretty amazing because that Amari Cooper is only like 20 grand. Uh, to the defensive side of the ball, we got Mark Barron over here as we wait for these images to come in. Uh, he's got that 99 hit power, which is what we love. Uh, Reggie Nelson, the BCA version, is great. And then Calvin to come in and make those interceptions when we need it. Also picked up the 24-hour Jones. He's nice. Uh, Patrick Chung backing him up. Uh, then we got Legends in Brooks and Zach Thomas. Because Zach Thomas is just a monster at stopping the run. So we love him. We have the most feared Khalil Mack. Also a beast. Uh, and I'm running the Patriots defensive playbook. So there's a lot of plays where he's going to come down and play uh, a DN position. Uh, speaking of the DNs, Randy Gregory. Uh, loved his Schefter Star card. Decided to go and spend a little bit of extra coin to get the Thanksgiving version. Uh, Harrison is great. Great block uh, great block shed and power. Uh, him and Poe pretty much just eat up a defend, uh, offensive linemen so that Watt and Gregory can do their things. As you can see, at 94, uh, Team of the Week Watt. Cornerbacks, we got Ty Law, Pat Peterson, uh, the, DR, the 90 Captain DRC. And the team of the week, Stephen Gilmore. Uh, really loving this defense. Probably, I kind of want to get like a new D tackle, just the one that can uh, 
do more than just take up guys. Someone that can break through and get those sacks. Uh, and also maybe another uh, middle linebacker. Someone that can uh, play well with Zach Thomas when I'm running some 3-4 defenses. Because, again, I have the Patriots playbook. Uh, so they have the 3-4 and the 4-3. So I'd like to get a second real good uh, middle linebacker for when I go there. Uh, on special teams, got King, got McManus. Had McManus forever. He's got 97 kick power. The only other option really is the Indomitian Sue out of position because he also has 97 kick power. Uh, and he can lay the wood. Uh, as you can see, Reggie Bush in there at the third down back position. Uh, as you know, if you're following the channel, you've been seeing a ton of Trinidad Holiday uh, kick return videos. Uh, I've recently just tried putting his bush in to see what happens. Uh, he's got some really good elusiveness and break tackle stuff. I actually played the first game I had him in. Uh, he broke three tackles on the opening kickoff, and the guy quit. I only got to like 25-yard line, uh, but he knew what he was in for, so he got out of there. Uh, next up, I want to tell you about a little giveaway we got coming up in this Monday. Uh, so make sure you're ready for that. Monday, January 11th, uh, I have a tweet out there that you need to retweet and follow me on Twitter at that sports gamer to be entered. Uh, during the national championship game, if Alabama wins, you will win the Ultimate Freeze 95, or not Ultimate Freeze, I think this is a Black Friday edition card, someone said. Uh, it's a 95 Julio Jones if Alabama wins. Uh, and then if Clemson wins, uh, we're giving away a 94 Ultimate Freeze, DeAndre Hopkins. I believe that's Ghost of the Future. Uh, this is on PS4. So I will uh, try to get the link right here, right on top of this thing right now. Uh, but if not, you can go into the description down below, and you'll see the link to that tweet. Just retweet that before the end of the game on Monday, January 11th, uh, to crown the national championship winner. And then we'll pull the giveaway, and uh, you have a good chance of winning. Uh, thanks for watching this video, guys. Really appreciate it. If you liked it, uh, sub the channel and give the video a like. Uh, if you have a suggestion on who should replace Ryan Khalil, I'd love to hear it in the comments down below. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy.